In today's YouTube video, guys, we are going to be taking a look at the newly buffed M4 here in Modern Warfare 3. Now, all Modern Warfare 2 weapons, their visual recoil got toned down a little bit, so every single Modern Warfare 2 weapon now is going to be a lot easier to use, especially with this M4 build. With today's gameplays, I drop you a back-to-back 100-kill -back game, a few MGB nukes as well you guys will enjoy. Now, before we get into all this, I do want to shout out today's Noted Gang, and if you want to see your name on tomorrow's video, all you got to do is like the video, subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new, and of course, comment Noted Gang down below. But anyways, guys, let's get into it. It. Now getting to my M4 build guys for the first attachment We are actually going to start with the rear grip here and add on the second ZX grip now the M4 We do all know that this weapon has a fast fire rate not the best recoil control So we will be adding this on we're getting some recoil control We're getting some gun kick control to make this weapon really easy into those medium to longer range gun fights up close You really don't have to worry about the recoil It's once you get into those longer range gun fights This attachment is going to help out a ton making the weapon easier to control in any gun fight Making it easier to shoot make it more accurate when firing so we are going to be adding this on for our first attachment here for the m4 now we're going to jump up here to the stock next here and add on the demo fade pro stock now this can help with aim walking movement speed and sprint speed so we are moving faster while aim down sides it is going to help out a ton if you do pre-aim a lot like myself i'm always pre-aiming around corners it helps me win those gun fights and also we are getting that sprint speed so we are moving faster around the map we're getting into more engagements getting those high kill games being more aggressive and also this is a great attachment to learn if you're trying to have that run and gun a aggressive play style this attachment will help out a ton so of course you want to add this on as well Next, we're going to jump all the way over here to the barrel here and add on the high tower 20 inch barrel. Now, every single time you use the M4, if it's my class it up, someone else's, you make your own, this attachment needs to be on. If you don't have this on, it makes this weapon a pea shooter at any range. You need to have this attachment on. It's going to help out a ton. We're getting bull velocity and range, recoil control, and hip fire accuracy. And to be more exact here, we are actually getting a 20% increase in our effective and minimum damage range. Our bulls traveling further they're hitting harder giving us a faster time to kill we're getting better recoil control to make the weapon easier to control at any gunfight also we are getting an 18 percent increase in our bull velocity so in any gunfight we have that advantage now extra damage faster traveling bullets you can't beat that at all especially on the m4 so that's why you want to have this on now, for the muzzle here, we are going to be going over here to the best muzzle here in Modern Warfare 3 as of right now, and that is the Zemin 35 Comp Stated Flash Hider. We're going to shorten that radar ping. You don't need a suppressor for this. We are getting some vertical recoil control, horizontal recoil control, and more firing aiming stability. This is going to help out a ton on this weapon. They did bring down the visual recoil, so you don't really need stability as much, but stability on this weapon, and still Modern Warfare 2 weapons is going to be nice. That's why I want to have it on here. And then going to my final attachment, guys, we are going to the underbar here and adding on the x10 phantom 5 hand stop grip sprint the fire speed aim down sight speed vertical recoil control and gun kick control just to help us be a little bit more aggressive aim down sights faster shoot faster off the sprint also giving us better recoil control at any range is going to help out a ton also if you guys want to the rest of my class it up here it is on screen now my secondary a lot of people has been requesting the class it up here it is on screen the stinger should be your main secondary that you run this should be the only secondary you run just because you are getting so much mobility it's going to help you move faster faster around the map and everything and this is the class up that you want to run just in case of an emergency of your primary running out of ammo you have to reload that this is a really good fast time to kill build that's really easy to control so go ahead and copy this down also i do recommend you actually changing up how your perks look i have scavenger i have the lightweight boots going on those are my main go-to's and we have a new gear perk which i've been trying out which is data jacker i went ahead and replaced this for the eod padding with the grenades actually getting nerfed you can no longer get one shot nade unless like a double nade or you're really weak or if a sims tech sticks you or anything like that but give the data jacker a try it's actually super fun you kill someone you pick up a smartphone and you get like a free ping on your mini map so it basically kind of works like a uav but try the build out let me know in the comment section if you drop any high kill games get any nukes any high gun streaks let me know but guys thank you so much for watching you guys stay safe and let's get in today's gameplays all right let's get busy with the m4 I'm, I'm feeling pretty good about this weapon. I'm actually... I, I really called this as well, like, not too long ago. Like, I even called, like, the subverter getting a buff. Like, well, I mean, it, it needed a buff, but I didn't... Well, I guess I said it... I'm hoping it does, so I technically, I guess, called it. My teammates could have saved me there, but, uh... I'm sure I'll get this comment already. I'm sure people have already will be saying it. Uh, people are probably going to be asking what this purple camo is, and this purple camo is actually from Hitting Iridescent from Modern Warfare 3 Season 2. 
uh, rank play. So we were on uh, demon time in uh, rank play this year. My goal is to hit iridescent every season. So hopefully I can keep doing that. Because I honestly love playing rank play. I just don't really... That's like that's really something I don't want to like up. Well, I upload it, but I don't really want to like stream it much or anything like that, because I just feel like I can't really talk to you guys while I'm in the games. It's really I gotta focus up and everything like that. But let's go ahead and get our first helicopter up here. They should spawn here too, so this should be fun. Let me see. I just, one thing I do have to watch out for is to do with the sword. So. That is one person I have to watch out for. That they'll be mad annoying. Wow, the visual like them reducing the visual recoil on this weapon helps out so much. Hold on. Okay, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Whoop. Oh my lord. Okay, let's let's focus up here. All right, teammate. Playing like a rat, it probably gets on a lot of people's nerves. But I am so down for it to do this. Alright, let's keep going. Perfect. I just got a random wall bang right there. Oh, some... It makes sense. Someone was behind that. Yep, there he was. Alright, one more kill and we have our first MGB. There we go, GG. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, I mean, everyone loves every time I upload this, it usually does pretty well, so I'm actually, I am actually glad it got buffed. And this guy's going crazy with the baton over here. That's actually kind of scary. I'm not really a big fan of melee weapons, but that dude is going like actually crazy with that thing. Let's keep pushing. All right, that dude, okay, he's shooting. I mean, honestly, we don't even need a, a 40 round mag or a 45 round mag on this gun. I mean, I'm mowing people down. Although I'm reloading often, the reload speed's pretty quick, so. I don't I don't really care about that. We're on a 42 gun streak right now, and they're spawning in front of me. I'm guessing they, I'm guessing they changed the spawns on this map. I mean, I, I guess it's cool, but I'll be honest. Like, I really don't like playing shipment too much. But right now, a free trial, I mean, you cannot get better... You cannot get any better than that. There's someone in here. Next level camping, bro. What are we doing here? Alright, they're going to be spawning over here now. There we go. Oh, teammate came in clutch with that cruise. They should just make this a weapon to be usable in uh, rank play again. Because I am so down to use this. I remember it was in rank play for a little, little bit back in Modern Warfare 2. And that was so fun. We're on a 57 gun streak right now. Let me actually tee up right here real quick. I don't... Okay, hold on. There we go. One more kill and we have a... Okay, there we go. A 60 gun streak right now. Let's freaking go, man. You just can't run at me. That's... See, that's y'all's problem. Like I talked about in my yesterday settings video. If you're running automatic tax sprint or tax sprinting in general, you cannot just run around and just go into... Like, running towards someone. The sprint to fire speed is actually way slower on attack sprint than it is a normal sprint. So you have to be real careful. Oh my god. Okay. A triple headshot. Oh my god. We're on a 76 gun streak right now. Can I get to can I get to a 90 gun streak real quick? Because that would actually be insane. Actually, if actually if I can get to a 98 gun streak, or a 99, to be fair, I have to get to a 99 gun streak to beat my uh, highest kill streak. And well, we're not getting that, so it doesn't really matter. We won't talk about it anymore. That was like really embarrassing aim right there out of me, though. But hey, we almost just tied our highest gun streak. That would have actually been crazy. Oh, is that a dude? No. Teammate, I'm going to trust you to look behind me. Let me see here. There we go. 
Oh, I, I just got hit with a gas nade. Those things are so annoying. I'm really tempted since, like, I don't really run EOD anymore. I'm really about to start running, uh, what is it called? I'm about to start running Tac Mask. But I feel like if I run Tac Mask, I have to run EOD. So, I, I don't know. Ah, right, there we go. Uh, 104 kills. I, I really wouldn't have used this gameplay, but we did go on, like, a high gun streak. So, that's, like, the, literally the only reason why we're using this gameplay still. I'm very, uh, I'm very picky with my gameplays that I upload. Hey, we're breaking ankles out here. I love this little Uzi. It's so nice. I get Stinger, Uzi, I don't know what y'all really call it, but uh, we'll go ahead and nade out over there. Let me see here. Alright, we got another helicopter. I mean, we have an endless supply of these helicopters, so. Let me see. 116 kills. Well, we're definitely pick up in the pace. That's that's for sure. Okay, they're just sliding. All right, give me an advance UAV. Treat me good here, COD. All right, we got an EMP and the advance. All right, how much time do we have here? That's going to be the real question. We're at 122 kills. I might be able to squeak out one more nuke. Not with spawns like that happening. That is for sure. All right, I got to take advantage of this. Oh, he's running an M4 too. I mean, it's just... We live in an M4 world. All right, I got to call the nuke in now. I might be able to get this. We're like three or four kills off. I just got to reload this real quick. See, you just can't freak out, man. Let's go. We just, we clutched that up. Let's freaking go, man. A triple nuke. 143 kills with the buffed M4. A lot of people quit on the other team, but this was a pure pub stomp. Let's freaking go, man. Easy. 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 Oh, my God. The aim is good today. Yep. Oh, y'all just like triple team right there. Y'all are weird for that. Yeah, but the aim has been real good here lately. I don't know what it is. We got, we got a brand new aim controller, which I will say... um. Still, everyone that's been buying a brand new controller, I do appreciate that. We are one, like, you know, the more code uses we get on uh, aim controller, we are get closer to getting our own custom-made controllers. So, it does help out a ton if you go buy one. It doesn't have to be crazy expensive either. You can customize them to be pretty cheap and still have, like, a really solid good controller. And I'm dead. There was no way in the world I'm surviving that. Also, I've been thinking about, um, what is, also, I've been thinking about putting, like, three gameplays in the videos instead of just, uh, I didn't even see him. He's playing weird, too. Yeah, I've been, I've been kind of thinking about, a lot of you guys have been watching the gameplays and everything. I may start doing three gameplays. I mean, the gameplays don't last, like, 20 minutes, so, I mean, it wouldn't, the videos wouldn't be much longer, so. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna flank around. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna play that safe. Imagine I just got sniped. This guy's weird for using a knife. Nah, I mean, I use him. Thank God for a good hip fire. Dang, bro. Like, this is COD timing right now that I don't want. This is the COD timing I do not want. And I'm just getting slayed. Okay, bud. Alright, go ahead and get that nade off. That's a kill. Maybe not. I lied. Alright, they're behind me. The data jacker is actually so nice of a perk as well. So I don't, I really don't know if I want to run tack mask or if I want to run data jacker. It's it's really, it's a coin toss to be honest. All right, let's see if we can get a swarm here though. I'm really wanting to get a swarm. I haven't got one in a couple days. Really didn't play much yesterday, so. Okay, this guy just jump-shotted me from across the map. Dear Lord, I just got gunned. Oh, teammate just came in crazy clutch right there. Thank you so much. 
All right, we'll go ahead and stun, uh, stun nade. All right, let me push in. Of course, thank God for the nice drop shot there. Where's he at? This game is pretty close still. There we go. All right, let me get this advance. Yeah, you're not killing me anymore, bozo. All right, hold out EMP as well. Oh, and guess what? And I have an advanced UAV for you. Hold that one too. Perfect. They're going to be spawning right here like crazy. Hold on. I, I trust six bullets. I have to clutch up when I get the... When I only have six bullets left, I really play super slow. I'm going to risk jumping in here. You're not killing me. I told you. And, well, I guess Fire Tomato is. I mean, that's cool. Dang, bro. Like, I am choking this game. This is not like me. Uh, he's going to Ego Chow. Yeah, he shouldn't have done that one. Oh, homie just ran right past everyone. Hey, you got bad internet. Okay, I'm dead. Oh, shit. All right, teammate. I'm, I'm going to push in here real quick. All right, we got another helicopter. I'm just kind of like... Is he chasing? Don't chase. I mean, what could I have done? I was literally... There was so much going on right there. No, man. 66 kills without a nuke. This is kind of depressing out of me. I mean, you can... Uh, homie can be there all he wants, and I think I just ran past someone, too. Let me see. I'm gonna push in here. Alright, teammates. I, I literally had them distracted. What are we doing? What are we doing? There we go. We got the wall bang. Is it, okay, so with them spawning on that side, that means they're going to be spawning over here, correct? Am I right? I mean, I might be. Yeah, I am. I'm going to get on this side of the map. Yeah, get gun. Get, get gun, son. And I guess my character forgot what a door looks like. Okay, cool. Oh my god, we just took out all four of them with one mag. One important thing is you have to be accurate and you have to... You gotta, you gotta be accurate, man. See, I, I know, you know, having extra bullets can help. But... You have to be accurate, man. Super important that you are. Hold on, I'm gonna push through here. Again, if my, if my dude knows what a, a door is... I'm gonna just push back up this way. I would like, I would love to get this advanced UAV. I got spotted. Hey, I mean, on like, I can't. This is the word I can't say. Statistically, I, I, this is just a word I can never say. Analytically, I mean, we'll, we'll just say that. The SVA is better than the M4. It is. And, I mean, I, I swear it's only me. This is the only stuff I died to. Alright, we'll, we'll keep going. I mean, this might just 
This might be just a game where I just drop a high amount of kills. I mean, sometimes it happens. Sometimes it happens. Not every great player can drop a nuke in a game. Not every game. Alright, we got another helicopter. Ooh. This is a great time to push around here. Perfect. We love those spawns. Yeah, fire tomato, you're not killing me. And I... I mean, I don't know where I died. There he is. 115 kills. Let me see. I mean, we could clutch up a... You just love how they spawned right there. I literally watched him spawn. I don't like doing that a crazy amount, but, I mean, it's nice. Alright, we got another helicopter, too. Wall bang. I don't know if this is wall bangable. It's not. That's sad. Just give me the skill gap that I want, bro. Let me shoot through walls. Just let me shoot through walls, man. I think we're actually going to get our nuke here. Alright, we will call this in. Uh, we're only on a 17. I'm over here talking like I'm on a, like a brutal or something. What the hell? Alright, so we have more map control. The helicopter is coming up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hey, I will say, I love them spawning in front of me. Yes, sir. This tryhard thinks he about to get away with not me getting a nuke. Doesn't he? Uh-oh, hold on. All right, three more kills. Come on. Because we only have 30 seconds here. Okay, we got it. Awesome. I was like... I, di I didn't... I, oh, I didn't know that you could... Get up there and it still count as a nuke or hard point spot. I guess I'm learning something new every day on this map still. Okay. We'll stun check that. Let me see. Yeah, this was a really bad map for nukes, but also it was a nice game for kills. So, I mean, I, I'm not mad at this, but we are going to go ahead and call this MGB in. First game was 143 kills. Our second game... We finished at 157 here before the nuke went off. I mean, this guy thinks he's good or something, man. I swear. He, he does. He's not. He might have killed me a lot, but hey, I killed him a lot as well. All right, our nuke should give us at least one kill. Okay, maybe maybe not, but we dropped 160 kills. We did get an extra kill there, but we got a nuke. A little rough there at the end, but we got it still, but 160 kills with this M4 build. Let's go.